number 16. I'm just going to start to set it up. I notice that none of these have the same base. That's important to note because some of my exponent properties are only applied if the base are the same. I'm going to set up my fraction. I'm not even going to attempt to start to square or first any of these until I've gotten rid of the negative exponent. So I'll start with 6. It will become 6 squared. I'm not even squaring it yet. I like to go a little bit slower through these. There's not much work. If you know what you're doing, doing this extra step is not that much time. 2 to the negative first becomes 2 to the first. Cross the line, change the sign. And then b to the negative fourth needs to go in the numerator and become b to the fourth. Next, b to the fourth is going to be my final answer. And in order to simplify these, I just need to actually expand them or multiply them out like this. And then I'm going to simplify 2 in 36 to be b to the fourth over 18. That's just standard simplifying fractions. Be careful. It's tempting to want to subtract these, but it's just 2 over 36, which is 1 18th.